Hi, I'm Chris Buck, a guitarist from Wales, and I play in the band Cardinal Black. I started playing Revstar guitars in 2016 after, to be honest, I was initially drawn to the way they looked. I just think they're incredibly cool looking guitars. I've since worked with the Luthiers at Yamaha Guitar Development in Los Angeles to design my own custom Revstar, and now I'm incredibly happy to introduce a brand new Revstar range. Revstar originally launched in 2015. The concept was inspired by classic cafe racer motorcycles. The double cutaway shape references classic Yamaha guitars like the SG-1000 or SBG-1000 in the US and the Superflighter series. The headstock is inspired by the SA-15, one of our earliest electric guitars from the 1960s. The new Revstar body is slightly bigger than the original, but weighs less because of a new chambered design. The chambering is not just for weight relief. Our engineers used advanced analysis and modeling to develop a new chambering pattern to achieve a specific tone and increase resonance. We call this process acoustic design. There are three tiers in the new Revstar range, Element, Standard, and Professional. Revstar Element has a mahogany body and neck with a rosewood fingerboard. It's got two humbuckers, three-way switching, and our dry switch high-pass filter. Revstar Standard adds a maple cap to the mahogany body and a carbon reinforced neck for stability and resonance. It's available with either humbuckers or P90 style single coil pickups, five-way switching for extra versatility, and our focus switch passive boost. Revstar Standard also comes with a gig bag and both the standard and element tiers include left-handed models. Revstar Professional is made by our master luthiers in Hamamatsu, Japan. It's also available with humbuckers or P90 style pickups and the focus switch boost and comes with a hard shell case. A carbon insert in the body was developed with our acoustic design process to further shape the vibration transfer and get the sound and resonance we wanted. Revstar Professional guitars also receive our IRA treatment, which stands for Initial Response Acceleration. We apply specific vibrations to the finished guitar to release stresses between the components for a new guitar that feels and sounds more like an instrument that's been played in for years. The guitars are designed to be versatile. In addition to the pickup options on Revstar Standard and Professional, all three tiers have an additional feature activated by a push-pull switch on the tone control. The dry switch on Revstar Element is a high-pass filter that can tighten up bass and provide brighter tonal options. Because it's a filter, there are advantages over a traditional coil split. You don't have a power drop or any additional noise. Standard and professional models have the new focus switch. This is a passive boost and the effect is similar to overwhelmed pickups. It rolls back high end, boosts the mids and bass, and gets darker and more aggressive for a different character. The standard and professional tiers also feature five-way switching. Position one is the neck pickup, position five is the bridge, and position three is both together. Positions two and four use both pickups with one slightly out of phase for a different take on classic in-between sounds. They're two pickup guitars with the versatility of three pickup guitars, offering some new sounds that you don't have in your collection yet. You can hear them now at your local Yamaha guitars dealer. The versatility of the new Revstar is really a big selling point for me. It works really well playing through effects pedals. It bows really well. The pickups sound amazing, and I felt like there was such a diverse array of sounds that I could get out of the guitar just by experimenting with the different tone and pickup settings. When I first started playing the Rev Star, I noticed it was real resonant. And what I mean by that is there was this kind of like powerful sound that came out of it without me having to do much to it. And I was pleasantly surprised. When you've played the same guitar your whole career, you kind of expect you're not gonna like anything else, but I love the diversity and it feels kind of like, like a blank paper and I can do anything. If you look at my Instagram, it's all rep store. That's all I've been playing. But the new one right now, it is a much lighter model, which I prefer because for me, just tapping all the time and just strumming, kind of moving around, it gives me more movement. And it's so clear. It's almost like an electric acoustic when you play it by itself, so. I, I was really happy. I was like yelling. I was like, oh! When I saw it in real life, I was like, that, that's the one. <laughs> it's something familiar, but unfamiliar at the same time. At first, I thought that I was completely stuck to other types of guitars. And next thing you know, I pick up something and I'm like, oh wow, 
I think this might be my thing. My favorite thing about the new Rev Stars is it feels great to play. So the way it sits on your body, the way it balances on the strap, and the way it feels whether you're sitting or standing. I also really like that the new Rev Star is chambered. That gives the guitar a really unique tonality and a resonance that's unlike any other guitar I've ever owned. With every chord you play, it just the whole body vibrates. I think the first thing that surprised me about the new Rev Stars was the added versatility of that five-way switch. It's not a guitar that tries to emulate other guitar sounds, it's just entirely its own thing. I think the biggest difference I've seen between the new Rev Stars and the old one is just a consistency in terms of resonance and liveliness under the fingers, which is just incredibly inspiring to play. All of my favourite guitars have that quality in them, that sort of just dynamic response and attack and just a resonance which then translates whether you're playing acoustically or whether you're playing plugged in. And for me that was very much what the Rev Star absolutely nailed. 